in this tutorial today, we are going to be learning about find and replace options in Microsoft Word. We are going to be using the content of this document as example. There are three methods you can find content in a document. The first method is you go to view tab and click on it, select navigation pane. This will bring up the navigation pane. Whatever you type here, Word will locate it within the document. So we have 17 appearances of house in this document. The second method is to go to home tab, click on it, select find. This will bring up the navigation pane and you find what you are looking for. It could be house, could be any other thing. Then the third method is to use the shortcut, which is Ctrl plus F. It will still bring up the navigation pane. So let's say in this document, there was an excess use of building and we want to replace it with designs. This could be anything, but in this tutorial, we concentrate on building. To find out the number of times that the word building appear in this document, I use the shortcut Ctrl plus F, then I type in building. We'll notice that building appeared 28 times in this document. Let's look for find and replace. We find and we replace the buildings with designs. From home tab, you go to replace editing group, click on replace. This dialog box will come up, click on more. You will notice that the building we type in last has been displayed. I say after find, we have replace. So you say find what? We are looking for building. Then we want to replace it with designing. You may decide to change it manually, but it can consume a whole lot of time. When I click replace, it will replace building with designing one at a time. But when you click on the replace all, a dialog box will come up asking you to replace the 26 remaining places that building appeared. When you click OK, then it has replaced all. We now have designing in place of building. Another thing you can still do with find and replace is to change the font, the underlining, or the color of a word within the document. When we click on replace, we make sure there is nothing here. Then we put our cursor in find words. Select format, select font. Now we have some of the words, they have blue color and they are bolded. We want to select them, so we select bold. So it has shown us what word we'll be looking for in this document. We click OK. What we'll be searching for bold. We click on replace with. We'll go to format, select font. We want to replace it with bold italic. We want it to have underline. Then we want to change the colors from blue to green. So we we'll click OK. You notice we have blue color in some of these places. So I select replace all. You say we have 25 replacement. Do you want to continue searching from the beginning? So if I click yes, it says all done. We made 28 replacements. So you click OK. If we close this dialog box, you will notice that all the places that have blue and those that have bold, they have been replaced with green color and they are underlined. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial today. If you did, please give this video a like, subscribe to my channel, click the bell icon so YouTube will notify you once I drop a new video. And do share this video with family and friends. Have a wonderful day.